If you not subscribed to Stella Gang yet, what you waiting for? Come on, join the squad, man. Stella Gang got the city hot. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that bell notification so you notified every time I drop a new video, man. BMG got the city hot. Y'all niggas know what's going on, man. What's good, Stella? Gang, it's your boy Class, and you are now tuning into the Realist Reaction Channel on the tube. I need everyone to like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell notification so you're notified every time I drop a new video. Today, I'm going to be reacting to Siggy Black Champagne. You feel me? So without further ado, let's get straight into it and see what he got to say. You worried about beef, nigga. I was drinking champagne. Like, a lot of you, like, that shit right there hit different. Because, like, you know what's crazy? I, I like that bar. Like, you feel me? Like, in relations to me, that's how true it is. They coming for you, Siggy. You just, you just killed that bar. They coming for you. <laughs> nah, I'm fucking. But anyway, like, in relations to me, I like that bar because just of a simple fact, like, a nigga get money, I be enjoying life, right? And it got a lot of you bum ass niggas that's trying to beef with me. You feel me? You worry about beef while niggas is celebrating, niggas popping bottles, and you worry about beef. That goes to show y'all niggas, beef is a broke nigga sport. When you get money, you thinking about how you gonna spend it, what you gonna do. You ain't think about no beef. You think about beef, you must be a butt to man. Hollows crack him like a fortune. He should have said cookie as I live with some shit. We know what he mean, but you feel me? It might go over some people here. Nah, that wasn't a good ball, bro. Gang in the bushes ready to abort. Nah, that wasn't a good bar, you feel me? Like if your gang is aborting, that means they they running, they backing out of the mission. Like they usually say shit like that, like, oh abort mission, abort mission. So your gang ready to abort. Y'all in the bushes hiding, y'all ready to run. That wasn't a good bar, you feel what I'm saying? And like a lot of niggas gonna try to use the abort shit as an abortion, but we know that's not what he mean. Cause if you have common sense, what the fuck would be in the bushes for abortion for? And then somebody's gonna use the fact that these babies, nigga, then that means that they will be killing their damn self. Like you feel what I'm saying? So I ain't gonna leave no room for you stupid niggas to say some stupid shit in the comment section. Not this time. Hey, let's go for it. I'm not social, but I'm business. When I click it. That was a that was a calm ball. I'm not so sure, but I'm distance. It was a calm ball. Like, I'm not so sure, but I'm distance. You feel me? I would have said I'm not so sure. Keep your distance. 
You feel what I'm saying? Cause I, like it's I know what he's saying is a good bar, but when you it's it's how it's just like one two words that change the whole shit. I'm not social, but I'm distant. I'm not social, keep your distance. You feel me? I'm not social, keep your distance make more sense. Because you saying I'm not social, but I'm distant. You basically just said the same shit twice. I'm not social, but I'm, I, I, if you distance, that means you you anti-social, anti-social. You feel me? So you just said I'm not social, but I'm distance. This is really like the same shit, but I get what you're saying. It's a calm ball. transition like I see it he's making that transition he's getting a lot better and he's he's creating better music he's finding new sounds he he's way more clearer than he used to be he making progress with this music shit he just need that extra drive to stay focused and just be on music heavy you feel me you need to be around niggas that's actually just gonna be straight motivation nobody that wants to milk you nobody that just want to do features because they trying to build their career too you need somebody that's around you that's gonna actually you feel me like yo bro listen i, I get on your shit because i ain't gonna front i i know siggy in real life you feel me that's my little bro so like I seen his progress. I remember nigga, I was gonna be the first person to ever bring Siggy to the studio. I don't remember what happened. He didn't end up he didn't end up coming with, with me to the studio that day and shit or whatever. But nigga, like I I watched Siggy start from the beginning. Like, you feel me? I remember when he used to bring his raps and rap to me in the building, bro. What you think about this shit? You like this shit, bro? I remember, you feel me? He used to been telling me, yo, I'm trying to do this rap shit and take it serious. At first, I used to be like, bro, you, you chatting, bro. You just want to rap because everybody else is rapping, bro. He like, nah, bro, I'm going to take this shit serious. When he had came out from, he was locked up for a little bit. And he had came out and shit. You feel me? But anyway, like, I like I like his his progress, man. He doing he doing his thing. This I give this right here eight. I like the little, you know how he got the little harmony and all that. And then the little... Oh, uh, uh, it bring life to you, feel me? Give it a different vibe. So, I give it an 8. I like this shit. I can rock with it. I'm not just saying it because it's Siggy and that's my little bro. I actually like this shit. So, I need y'all to let me know in the comment section below. If y'all feel like I rated it too high or I rated it too low, it's your boy Upper Class. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and the bell notification so you're notified every time I drop a new video. <laughs> After you subscribe, remember this. Whenever you watch my videos, it's all jokes, man. You gotta come over here and get a laugh. Don't hate me because I gave you a low rating. Hate yourself because you ain't make a fire song. <laughs> it's your boy BMG, man. Good.